What better way to kick things off following such a jolly, happy, fun time holiday like Christmas than by punishing ourselves in trials, right? Well, today's track is an older recommendation by someone who actually brought it up back when I first mentioned that I could do these multiplayer hack source type tracks, which I means that the hacks were about it. Really, anybody could do it. All you need is ba it's basically a friend and go in multiplayer and then you could tackle any track or you can just use a secondary account and pretty much forever alone your way through a thousand faults or so because that sounds like so much fun, right? Anyways, as you can see, there are some serious gaps in this track, and the only reason why this guy can make it look so damn easy is because either one, he's a neckbeard who lives in his fat whore mom's basement with his boyfriend, or, you know, he isn't riding a donkey. Like his mom! So we kick things off with a three week old recording. That's right, this is the very first take on this particular course, and <laughs> I think I recorded it during a donkey spree, which 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 happens. Sometimes you just go on, you knock out a whole bunch of tracks, and you just say, okay, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and just pick one of these for Will Donkey, and then that's it. Now, obviously not disclosing whether or not this is donkeyable, we're gonna go ahead and tackle this thing one obstacle at a time. I did say this is the first take. I'm guessing you guys probably already know this could be more than one. And as you can see, the first obstacle is obviously fucking hard. I mean, all I have to do is just get enough, get enough forward momentum to just land on that first, like, swing set chair, bounce to the next one, and then bounce, just, it's so easy in my head. It's, but, but how I get there is the problem. So I try a couple different things. I try the, the, the let's try to put my face on it and see what happens approach and work out. I try to do some like under trapeze bullshit where like, I hook it with my front tire and somehow magically flip over the underside. That didn't fucking work. I tried the let's do an awesome foot flip and then land on the back tire and somehow use that kind of strange nonsensical momentum to carry me to the next one. That didn't work out. But this particular move seemed to. It's basically spin all the way around, slam the back tire, and use that bounce to carry to the next one, and then hope that you have enough to make it to the third platform. Didn't always work out, but it seemed to be the thing that got me the closest. But of course, as you can see, close doesn't count, horseshoes, hand grenades. I know, I know. In the end, the one thing that worked was just fucking just drive off the sh just just do this. Fucking kidding me? But at least we get a pretty good look at what's coming up. The next handful of obstacles, as you can see, big fucking gap, big fucking gap, big fucking gap, and a tiny little gap right there. Now what's missing from this picture? A checkpoint! Even at the very end, there's no checkpoint over there! What the f- There's a- There's some stairs bullshit that I can see it from here, but there's no checkpoint! And then the donkey's giving you shit, it's all like, oh, I can't make that, nope. It's just, it's just, you have to really fucking push it. And then when you do land on this platform, which is totally possible, I just haven't figured out how to do it yet, then you have to be really careful, because once you land on it, then you have to just kind of ease your way off of it to make the next one, and the next platform, and then make it to that last one, where you have to obviously tackle this fucking stairs shit, with no checkpoints again. Now let's go ahead and speed things up a little bit, because as you can see by the progress bar at the top, that there's not a whole lot of obstacles, okay? There's probably like five or six total major chunks, with like, you know, two fucking checkpoints. Oh, by the way, don't get excited, because I didn't make this. 20 something faults later, I'm getting pretty good at landing this, all right? I'm just hitting it and it's like, it's just working out. Now, here are the stairs that we were waiting for. You can see the checkpoint right on the other side. And you can also see that every stair is pretty fucking high. It's just, it's just the right amount of height. Obviously, all of my, all of my earned skills and experience in saving my own ass every time I do a backflip or I'm falling backwards or something, is coming into play here. You can see the backflips and of course, uh, keeping my balance as I'm going backwards. All of this stuff comes into play. All you have to do is just hit it just right. And I can see that right there. At that moment, I'm like, okay, I just need to hit this perfect. Just kind of clip each edge and make it to the top. And then I can just fall over to the other side. That's all I need to do. Just like this. Perfect. See? All right, now stop. Fast forward three weeks. I decided to go ahead and pick it up again for an episode of Will of Donkey, okay? This is today. And I was just like, all right, let's go ahead and do this. This is a hard track. I want to go ahead and give it everything that I have to make a really good episode. I want to make it entertaining for you guys. As you can see, I'm completing some of the obstacles, some of the checkpoints, in about a third or half the amount of faults, naturally, because I already know the course, okay? So I'm going to do pretty good. Good over these stairs here. I already know the stairs. I already know what to do. Okay, I have my own bag of tricks. Here we are at this obstacle. Now let's go ahead once again and stop. All right, here we go. We're gonna go ahead and run this. This time, we're gonna do pretty good on time, all right? Because I, I am an ace at this. Third fault, no problem. Look at this. Beautiful, the most beautiful transition ever. 35 faults, that's actually really low. For a third attempt, come on, that's great. 
Make it over this. Stop right here. Hey, look, it's those stairs. The dreaded stairs. Oh, look out for these guys. They're fucking stairs. They're squarey and great. Get over the fuck at the fast forward. Jesus Christ. All right, here we go. Now, stop. Computer, please pull up all feeds. Thank you. Please execute fuck everything program. .exe run enter. All right, it's good. This is perfect, actually. Okay, now, what I need you guys to pay attention to here is how much this fucking obstacle sucks! No, seriously, I, I had plans! I, I, I looked at this and I was like, oh, I've done this obstacle before, no problem. I could just bounce my back wheel off this, spin around, with, hook it, and fap the X button or the left trigger, whatever I feel like doing, and then make it over to the top, no problem! And no, it's not that fucking easy! I don't even think I need to tell you guys how many fault I put into this, because it doesn't matter, because it's fucking obstacle. <laughs> Look, all right. So, all, all, all I, I, there's so many, to, Dad is frustrating, he's watching back. Look, I feel like this might be possible, but at the same time, I've done everything. Look, here, here, let's stop right here. We've already done the, let's bounce the back tire, spin around, grab it with the front, and then try to land it. That, that doesn't work, right? You can't just... Hit the ramp and then land on top of it either. It's too much of an angle. You can't, you, there's no way you could build up that kind of momentum because there's the fucking st the stairs right behind you. So you can't even get a good running start to just slam into it and then bounce like straight up almost. Doesn't work. Okay? You can't do a front flip because you hit the wall. So here's, here was my, 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 my thinking. I, I thought that maybe I could take my little dude here, right? And you guys have seen me do this before. As a matter of fact, in this episode, you've seen me do this before. Uh, and, and I can do it, but I don't think it's possible here. It's not possible here, all right? Take him out. Do, 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 do. Okay, we're gonna move him. Look at me. Oh, I'm a little dude. Oh, look at okay, look. And take him and then just slide him right on that. Boom, right there. See? See? If I if I could land that, if that can happen, then I could do this. That that's the only way this could be done. And it's it's fucking hard to get just this perfect little angle here because you you hit the damn the ramp and it, it doesn't give you you can't fucking do it! It's not possible! Okay, look, look, you start off, and you, you lean forward a little bit, pulls the back tire off the ground, then you lean back, and it gives you a little bit of extra spin, okay? And then you hit this, you jump up, and then you just gotta hook your tire right there, but you can't slow down enough in mid-air to hook it! Because you're still spinning backwards, and so you're fucking hit your back against the thing, or you clip it like this, and it just spins you right off. <sighs> and, and, and I try! My god, do I try! I try, I try all the time in this incident. Look, this is not fucking possible. This track is not donkeyable by anyone. It's not happening. I refuse to, 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 no, I've tried so many goddamn times. Fucking goddamn it. And for those of you guys who are like really amazing at trials and you're like, oh, I could totally make this. Fine, go ahead, go, go make it over this jump. You're not gonna make it over this. So ladies and gentlemen, yes, this track will not donkey. You're welcome, finally, right? Fuck. <laughs>